two inches of sleet that you saw there falling, ping, 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 ping. Yeah, that's what it sounds like. Imagine two inches of that. It's like sugar, honest to goodness. Now, take a look at this radar, and you'll say, wow, that's a little small area. But folks, this is intense precipitation as we zoom in toward Fort Smith and Fayetteville. The blue and the enhanced white snow, moderate to heavy at times. South and east of Fort Smith, Arkansas, we've had reports of uh, thunder sleet. That is right, the lightning bolts are right there. You can see it just to the south of Greenwood. This is an intense area of sleet. The temperatures are only in the teens to around 20. So whatever is coming out of the sky, folks, is gonna make for treacherous travel right there. Seth and Weather Command, thank you for circling that. It is lightning and thunder with heavy sleet falling. That is a rarity over any portion of the country, but it does happen from time to time. Oklahoma City, let's go to you. And the bitterly cold air is in place. I mean, temperatures right now are between 10 and 15 degrees. They're coming out of this slop fest. Uh, it's a skating rink out there. They're going to get up into the, <laughs> up into the, <laughs> it's balmy, 17 degrees uh, by the uh, dinner hour. So you get the idea as we go through time. And as we track this thing, it is going to go, like its uh, predecessor, the same track. Jet stream is such, nothing's been moving that river of air about 40,000 feet in the Earth's atmosphere. We're going to monitor the sleet, the areas of fuchsia, warm enough where uh, Will Nunley is for rain. It's going to become heavy at times. Again, timestamp after midnight tonight. They have flooding concerns just north and west of where he is in Nashville. There's icing concerns, and we have winter storm warnings in effect for Dallas, Oklahoma City, Tulsa, northern and central Arkansas can see three quarters of an inch of glaze, meaning like an ice cube, three quarters of an inch thick. That is a lot of ice that will coat everything. Power outages are possible as well. Kendall, not looking good. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.